Let's go live to Jonathan Cotto, who is covering a crash for us at New Mathis Road and Cannonwood Drive. Jonathan, the scene was clearing just moments ago. What's it look like now? Thank you, Stephen. A busy morning indeed. Right now, as you mentioned, the scene is clearing up. As we can see here, that Chevy Silverado involved in this deadly crash is now atop of that tow truck. In just a couple of minutes, folks out here that are trying to gain access to New Mathis Road will be able to do so here on New Mathis Road and Cannonwood Drive, where it all happened this morning. We know Bear County Sheriff's Office responded to the scene shortly after 3 o'clock. They tell us a male driver in his 20s was traveling eastbound on New Mathis Road when he hit the driveway in front of this home right there on your screen. You can see now that we have some daylight, the, the impact on that concrete barrier over that driveway where he impacted it. The truck went airborne, he was ejected, and unfortunately his own truck landing on top. Now we are told that uh, the driver is not from this area, so it's unclear what he was doing in this area at that hour. Uh, police also tell us that they found open containers inside of his vehicle as well. The details of this crash, of course, are under investigation. We're going to remain on scene and uh, update you as more information is made available. Reporting live from Southeast Bear County, Jonathan Cotto, KSAT 12 News.